on to do something like this. So, so far, ladies and gentlemen, we've talked about when, how we graph it and determine all the values, right? Yes? Okay. Now, what I'd like to do is show you how to find all the information, if you can. So when I provide you information, I say, um, find the directrix, focus, or in sketch the graph, what we're going to have to do is go ahead and plot the information that we have. All right. So if I'm going to go and look at this, we know we have a vertex at 0, 0. So that one's nice and easy. Then it says my focus is at 0, negative 2. Okay. Now, if the focus is facing downwards, what makes it possible for where my graph is going to open or my parabola is going to open? Is it going to open up? No. To the left? To the right? It has to open down, right? Huh? Are you doing No, but I'm trying to make this think as like, yes, this can be as obvious as that fact that here's the vertex. The focus has to, obviously we talked about this focus has to be inside that parabola, right? So if you have the focus going down, you know the parabola is going to go down. So that's 0, 0. And this is going to be 0, 2. We'll, we'll go over a problem like that. But, it, but in this example, you can't have one, right? It has to be going down. Because you couldn't have um, anything like that. So now, in the next case, um, so now when going looking at this, well, I remember this distance is my negative p, right? My p is negative. So we remember the distance from the focus to the directrix is exactly the same, right, TJ? Yeah. So what you can simply do is add to, and I can now say this is a horizontal line, so y equals positive 2. All right? So now we need to write the equation of the graph. All right? Write the standard equation of the graph. So now what I want to do is go ahead and write in, since this is a horizontal or a vertical graph, I know it's going to come in the form of x has to be squared. So x minus h squared equals. 4p times y minus k. Now, we already talked about, yes, Haley. OK. So we already talked about the vertex. The vertex is at 0, 0. So I can put in x minus 0 squared equals 4 times x minus 0. Now, p, remember, if you didn't write this down, write it down again. p is the distance from the vertex to your focus, including your direction. So this distance from this distance from 0 to negative 2 is p, which is my negative 2. So therefore, this is 4 times negative 2. Is that a y? Yeah, there, sorry. So now, my final equation of my graph. x squared equals negative 8y. P is your distance. No, 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 I know that, but on this Negative 2. Yeah, because it says the focus is at 0, negative 2. So the distance from the vertex to the focus is negative 2. Mm -hmm. 